Understanding the VC Dimension Definition, Contributors, Computation, and Applications Definition of VC Dimension The vapnik shervenenkis VC, Dimension is a fundamental concept in the field of statistical learning theory and machine learning. It measures the capacity of a statistical classification model, representing its ability to classify data points correctly. Formally, the VC dimension of a class of functions is defined as the largest set of points that can be shattered by that class. Shattering means that for every possible subset of these points, there exists a function in the class that can correctly classify the subset. If no set of a certain number of points can be shattered by the class but there exists a set with one fewer points that can, then the VC dimension of that class is that number minus one. Contributors to VC dimension the concept of the VC dimension was introduced by Vladimir Vapnik and Alexei Shervenenkis in their pioneering work on the theory of statistical learning. Their groundbreaking research laid the foundation for understanding the capacity and limits of learning algorithms, influencing the development of modern machine learning and pattern recognition. Vapnik, in particular, continued to contribute extensively to the field, including the development of support vector machines SVMs, which rely heavily on the principles derived from the VC dimension theory. How to compute the VC dimension Computing the VC dimension of a hypothesis class can be challenging, often requiring a combinatorial approach and deep understanding of the underlying functions. Here are general steps to compute the VC dimension. 1. Identify the hypothesis class. Define the set of functions you are considering. 2. Attempt to shatter sets of points. Begin with smaller sets of points and check if there exists a function in the class that can classify every possible subset of these points. 3. Incrementally increase the set size. Gradually increase the size of the point set and repeat the shattering process. 4. Determine the maximum shattered set size. The VC dimension is the maximum size of the set that can be shattered by the class. For example, consider linear classifiers in a two-dimensional space. A single line can shatter at most three points in general position. However, four points cannot always be shattered, e.g., if they form the vertices of a convex quadrilateral. Thus, the VC dimension of linear classifiers in 2D is 3. Applications of VC dimension The concept of VC dimension has significant implications in various domains of machine learning and statistics. Here are some key applications. Model selection and capacity control. VC dimension helps in understanding the trade-off between model complexity and generalization ability. Models with high VC dimensions can fit more complex patterns but may overfit the training data, while models with low VC dimensions might underfit. Bounding generalization error. VC dimension is used to derive bounds on the generalization error of learning algorithms. These bounds provide insights into how well a model trained on a finite dataset is expected to perform on unseen data. Support Vector Machines SVMs. The theory of VC dimension is integral to the development of SVMs. The margin maximization principle in SVMs is closely related to minimizing the VC dimension, leading to better generalization. Empirical Risk Minimization VC dimension helps in formalizing the principle of empirical risk minimization, guiding the selection of hypothesis classes that balance empirical performance and complexity. Active Learning in active learning scenarios, the VC dimension can be used to determine the number of samples needed to achieve a desired learning accuracy, optimizing the data acquisition process. Neural networks. The VC dimension of neural networks, although complex to compute, provides insights into their capacity and helps in designing architectures that avoid overfitting. Conclusion. The VC dimension is a crucial theoretical tool in understanding and designing learning algorithms. Introduced by Vladimir Vapnik and Alexei Shervenenkis, it quantifies the capacity of a model and informs various aspects of machine learning practice, from model selection to error bounding and beyond. Despite its computational challenges, the VC dimension remains a cornerstone in the ongoing development of effective and reliable machine learning systems.